So, are we ready for another baking video? Open cabinet wouldn't be a Shannon video without an open cabinet. Anyways, um, we're going to bake. It is 7 o'clock at night and we're going to bake. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and let you know I'm setting my oven to 350 before I show you the ingredients. And finish this intro. Okay, buddy. Just give me a second, okay? We are going to make a... Blueberry lemon dump cake. The Pinterest link will be down below. It looks delicious. So we're gonna try it. I'm gonna turn you around, show you what you need. Super easy. Four ingredients. Okay. Oh, this is also in the Dutch oven. I'm sure you could do this in a regular pan also, but I'm doing it in my Dutch oven because that's what the recipe says to do. All right, let me turn you around. All right, so you're gonna need blueberries. This is a 48 ounce bag. We're only gonna need about half. You need between 10 and 12 ounces of lemon curd, a can of Sprite, and a can, a can, nope, a box of yellow cake mix. I have my scale here so I can weigh the blueberries with the bowl. And then we have our Dutch oven here and our whisk. Let me get y'all set up on the tripod and we'll get started. I forgot to hit the record button. I put the 24 ounces of blueberries in my Dutch oven. I lined it with parchment paper because that's what the recipe said to do. Well, it said to use a liner. I don't have a liner. I didn't know they made liners for these. And then we're just gonna pour the whole jar of lemon curd. Take this. I'm going to take our yellow cake mix. We're going to take our can of Sprite. Y'all couldn't even see that. Mom, I'm sorry. you almost done, Mom? Yeah. What are you making, Mom? What are you making, Mom? Cake. What the What cake? Lemon blueberry cake. Yeah. Kids don't eat that. Yeah, it's so yummy. Mm. It's so sad. All right, now I'm just going to put the lid on. What angel blue cake now? And we're going to put it in our 350 oven and check it in 35 minutes. And then we shall return. Alright, 
right, the timer has went off. We're going to get it out of the oven and see what it looks like. Oh, that's heavy. I wonder what this orange stuff is. Definitely not ready. So, we're gonna put it in there for at least another 20 minutes, at least. Okay, full disclosure, I took this out while I was on my live. It actually took about an hour and a half to cook. We're gonna, sorry about the mess, get us a spoon and we're gonna get us a bite. Oh, it's really juicy. Wasn't expecting that. See, there's a lot of juice in there. Wasn't really expecting that. Let me turn it around. Taste it for you, but then I'm going to bed. I'm not eating a big old piece of it. Mm. Here's what I'm going to say. Does that have a good flavor? Yeah. I'm not a fan of the texture of the cake. Though. It's... It's cooked all the way. You can tell by looking at it. See? It's cooked all the way. But it feels really doughy in your mouth. Let me get the big piece of cake off. And we're just going to try like a little bit of cake with the blueberry. I'm going to be honest. 10 out of 10 would not make again. Mm -mm. Nope. And maybe after it cools, like in the morning, it might be better. So maybe before I edit this, I'll taste it and we'll see. But as of now, no thanks. Not doesn't have very good flavor. All right, that's going to be it for today. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.